My name is Doc Fugus. Welcome back to Octopath Traveler. Last time we recruited Alpha and the Apothecary. This time we will be recruiting Primrose the Dancer. At last. At last he's appeared before me. The man marked the crow. The man who killed my father. Her name is Primrose and she is a dancer. This is Sunshade. City of a thousand pleasures. Forever shrouded in the shadow. Driven into poverty when her noble house fell. She now piles her trade in a tavern, suffering no end of indignities. The hands of the cruel master, Helganesh. All for the day she could have her revenge. And one day he appeared, a man marked by the crow. One of the three foul villains who murdered her dear father. And so, aided by her soul friend, Yusufa, she sprints from the tavern to the labyrinth wall in pursuit. She will need loyal allies in the path she has chosen. And as per usual, we'll be replacing. I want to replace on it though. Okay. Even when the blade is held at your heart, faith shall be your shield. Words of House Azelheart. Ten years ago. Funny how it works, isn't it? Everything that happens in this world falls into one of two neat little categories. Things one is better off knowing, and things one's better off not. Jeffrey Azelhart, I'm afraid you've been poking your nose into the ladder. I have only done as my convictions bade me do. I have no regrets. I thought you might say something like that. You're making this delightfully easy. Father! Make sure he's dead. Let's leave this place before we're seen. <laughs> it's done. I will never forget. Three men, each marked with the sign of the crow. One on his left arm. One on his right. And the last on his neck. Three men, foul scavengers, just like the bird whose mark they bear. They took my father from me. And I will never forget. Always the same dream. I wish I had your confidence, Primrose. I couldn't imagine nodding off minutes before my cue. How nice it must be to be the master's favorite. <sighs> Fine. Go on and keep your airs. Act as though you're better than the rest of us. It doesn't change the fact that you're just another dancer in the sands, Primrose. Nothing but a kept woman, here to flatter the dignity of men who pay for the privilege. I suppose you're right. Uh, shh, enough chatter. Master Helganish is coming. Do I keep you women to titter here in the shadows? My customers are waiting for their entertainment! The opening act should be on that stage already. Now, get out there and earn your keep! Oh, what a bunch of useless strays. But not you, Primrose. You, 
are the only one I can rely on. You flatter me, Master. Oh, hardly. Why, this tavern's custom has increased tenfold since you stepped on our stage. But do not go forgetting yourself. It was I who groomed you for this role. And I will be forever grateful for that, Master. You were an ignorant girl when I picked you up. Completely useless. I've taught you everything you know. <laughs> what happened to your sweet little smile? Who puts a roof over your head and food on your plate? Who bought the jewels that adorn your pretty neck? Who made you the most sought-after dancer in this dusty old town? It was me! Oh, me! You owe me. Oops. My bad. Yes, Master. <laughs> Good then. Purr sweetly, and I may give you a treat. Don't dally when you're done with your show. I will be waiting in my chamber. I'll have you purr for me some more. Grimrose, it's your cue. I'm coming. Put your face back on now, kitten. Yes, master. The tavern lies at the end of the central road, just past Bazaar. I mustn't dally any longer. How are you? This way, Primrose, get a move on. Ah, there you it's are. It's waiting long enough, Primrose. Forgive me. I was fixing my hair. <laughs> <laughs> Better have been worth it. We're our best chance at getting to eat tonight. Customers have been waiting. <clears throat> I am ready. Let the show begin. It's her! It's her! Watch over me, Father. That day I swore revenge against the men who took you from me. The three marked by the crow. My once proud house fallen. I left home far behind, following their trail. That trail has led me here. I heard one of them often passed through here on his travels. It was the smallest scrap of hope, but it was all I had. When, until I find him, there is no disgrace I will not endure. Losing my honor is nothing compared to the pain of losing you. Father, I will not stop until I find the three and see justice served. Until I avenge you, I will dance. I think I'm in love. <laughs> How about a private show, darling? <laughs> you are all too kind and too handsome, I might add. <laughs> not bad, Primrose, not bad. <sighs> Thank you. <sighs> hmm. Look at your sandals. Seem you've gone and broken a strap. Go back to the dormitory and fetch yourself another pair. Yes. Most happily. Hey! Papa, hey! Papa, I'm gonna be in the play. <laughs> I'll be the princess and everyone will look at me. 
You'll come and watch too, won't you? Yes. Of course, my dear. Oh, thank you! Many thanks, my lord. To he. How was that? <laughs> Guess what, Papa? When I grow up, I'm gonna be a beautiful dancing girl, a star of the stage. Uh. <clears throat> a dancing girl? That is a dream best forgotten. <laughs> but why, Papa? Hmm. Elena, my dear, you want to grow up to be a fine lady, yes? With the princess you will play? Then it'll be better not to say such things. Not in this town, at least. Oh. What's wrong with dancing? It's so much fun. What? Look at her. She's she's beautiful. <laughs> Hello, child. Oh, come now. Elena, this way. I'll tuck you into bed back at the end. Papa has business to attend to this time. Hmm. Yes. I suppose I should get back to my own work. Uh. Ah! Ow. <laughs> A thorn. Oh, someone fetched a handkerchief. Primrose seems to be bleeding the poor dear. <laughs> Perhaps she got a blister. She's always dancing oh so passionately. Are you alright? Prim? Yes. I'm fine. It's something I haven't dealt with before. Hey! Don't you think that's enough already? Do you take such pleasure in others' pain? We're nothing but the master's playthings, all of us. We all know what happens to the girls who displease him, or have you forgotten? Beaten half to death and tossed in the gutter. Left for dead, sick and starving. S stop that! <laughs> we all know well enough where we stand. We know he what he can do to us. Then why torment on one of our own? Many thanks. Thank you, useful, but there's no need for you to make foes on my behalf. <sighs> Prim. Yo! What are you doing yelling back here? Sheathe your claws, it's time for work. Or do you think money flows into my coffers by itself? Get out there and collect your tips. Wait a minute. Not you, Primrose. You stay. What was that? What was that sorry show you gave today? Uh... I think not. Do you think I'm blonde? One glance was all I needed to know your mind was not where it ought to be. I can't see every thought in that pretty, empty little head of yours. They were not of dancing tonight. <sighs> you would take that tone with me? You haven't forgotten your debts now, have you? You haven't forgotten who owns you. You know the fate that awaits you if you dare defy me again. Don't you, kitten? Ugh. <laughs> uh, I'm warning you because I care, Primrose. I wouldn't want to see anything untoward happen to my shining star. Uh, forgive me. I'm sorry, Master. Forgive me. The truth is... I'm simply remembering the first day I came here to you. Oh, where are you now? <laughs> not a day, not a moment passes when I am not thankful for all you have given me. Pray forgive my lack of focus today, Master. It will not happen again. <laughs> oh, my dear, dear Primrose. <sighs> I too often think back on the day you came to my door. Just imagining the sight of you dancing for me, as sweet and innocent as you were, it tickled me so. You met my every expectation. You have seen. You have been my best investment. Hmm. I'll have you purr for me some more. But tonight you have displeased me. For that you must atone. Cry's looking thin tonight. I'm on the streets with you. And bring us some custom. 
impress him with coin enough to cover a week's expenses. If you can do that, I may still go easy on you. <laughs> At least relatively so, kitten. Yes. You are kind, master. <laughs> Bravo, Prim. That was a performance of the ages. How do you do it? I want to vomit every time I have to call him master. Mm -hmm. What are you doing here? Shouldn't you be out collecting tips? Are you alright? I was worried about you. How is your foot? What? What? Here, use this. Uh. A handkerchief. Uh. Be careful out there, okay? So as I said last time, her ability is the same as Ophelia's, but it comes with a price if you fail. <laughs> well, time to put on a different kind of show. <laughs> this one looks to be the likely sort. Excuse me. Lovely evening, isn't it, my lord? <laughs> Mayhap you'd care to share it with me? My apologies. Tempting offer, but I travel on business. I must depart early in the morrow. Hmm. Mm -hmm. It must be a fascinating sort of business that you do. Perhaps you could tell me more over a drink? <laughs> I'd love to get to know you better. Most unfortunate. I am most afraid I cannot. Excuse me. I dance at the tavern just down the street. <laughs> Be happy to put on a show just for you. Admit it now. Wouldn't you like to care? Wouldn't you care to spend a little more time with me? Oh, oh my! I cannot resist such beauty. Pray come, Heather. You are kidnapped. <laughs> yes, that one's pockets look sufficiently deep. Ooh. Excellent. Oh. Good work, kitten. You'll be treated well tonight. I'm getting sick reading this. Many thanks. Army master. <laughs> the seats are starting to fill. See that not a single cup goes empty. Yes. As you wish, master. Beg pardon. Good evening, gentlemen. Ah, <laughs> oh, Primrose, you're looking more and more lovely each time I see you. <laughs> It's been a while since we last enjoyed your company. Will you be with us long this evening? <laughs> uh huh. As long as you'll have me for my dear. <laughs> That's it. I'll have to give it some thought then. <laughs> I'll see you again later. <laughs> Till next time. Now that's all, I'll be taking my leave. <laughs> Could it be? There, on his left arm. mark of a crow. How long have I waited for this day? Finally you appear before me. This night at long last, justice will be served. <laughs> no. Uh. I can't let him get away. Yell. Yeah. Where do you think you're going? So curious about that man, are you? Was it love at first sight, kitten? <laughs> Master. I think not. You wouldn't think of abandoning the stage and your customers before the night is through, now would you? Back to work, Primrose. <laughs> Trust, I don't need to repeat myself. Put your face back on now, You do kitten. remember- Oh, my keyboard! You do remember what happens to the wicked kittens who cross me, don't you? Everything's going wrong. This is all I have. 
I'll never get another chance like this again. Are you all right? Prim, what's the matter? It's not like you. It's not like you look all flustered like this. Hmm. You need to tell me. For you to risk angering the master like that, it must be something important. Leave it to me. I'll keep his eyes busy. You should slip out the back door on the upper floor. Uh. You shouldn't get involved. You'll put yourself at risk. Look, Prim, maybe you don't tell me what you're thinking. Come on! But that doesn't matter to me. I'm on your side and always will be. Uh. On my side? When the other girls would pick on me and tell me to know my place, you were always the one who stood by me. You never say much. You're always so distant. Aloof, even. But I know you just don't want to be a burden on others with your troubles. <sighs> I know you better than you think, Prim. And I know that, deep down, you have a good heart. <laughs> a good heart? Yusufa. I... Thank you. <laughs> Always a woman of few words. Would have it any other way. Bring the woman I need, won't you now? Company and help is so hard to come by these days. Whatever is a man to do. <laughs> I can assure you, my lord, I'm doing all that I can. Hmm. Helganish, we're friends, are we not? Friends take care of one another, yes? They do not disappoint each other. Yes! I will do everything in my power. So I'll find dancing around the tavern. I would rather like a, such a girl of my own. <laughs> so this is I thought. Helganish knows him. Listen to me. Bring the woman to the place marked on this map. And Helganish, try not to keep me waiting. Yes! But of course, my lord. <laughs> that map. So I must pursue the foul crow. Don't get involved, this is my problem, not yours. But I suppose you're free to do as you please. Come on already, if you're coming. So I figure instead of waiting for combat, we should go over their combat no powers now. So, Primrose cannot do that. Primrose is able to use daggers and that is it for weapons. And as far as her skills go, Lion Dance. One ally's physical attacks become more powerful for two turns. Moonlight Waltz. Heavy dark damage to a single foe. So she is our dark attacker. Peacock Strut. Augment a single ally's elemental attacks for two turns. Which basically means it, it gives it gives him stat, like, more powerful. Physical defense increase. Dark damage to all foes. Ally speed for two turns. Beholder and Grace is a weird one that we will use later on. Basically, it's like your random things. So like, hey, this might do damage, this might heal you, this might do negative things. But it is great for grinding because it has a chance to increase the amount of XP gained. Now, we have lost our strongest attacker, so we are... Oh, actually, I want to go get Primrose equipped. We've lost our strongest attacker, so we want to This is the beginning of up. your end. My turn. Now, what next? 
Oh, ice! Here's some proof! I am ready. So, for example, we can do this on Alfin. The Lion Dance. This is your, your typical stab buffs, now he has more attack. Bring it on! Ah! Out of my way. Not bad. A passing grade. So immediately level four, and she can immediately get her first skill. Plus, Therion gets his next skill. Cyrus needs a thousand, and he's at five hundred. See, um, I think that's good, but I'm not entirely sure. We're actually gonna go for Shacklefell. That gives him fleet flip. Speed by 50, okay. That makes him for sure the fastest. And we'll make Primrose actually learn Night Ode at first. And then we'll go for Touch Start, I think. We want to look for the weapon store, wherever that is, over here. Ooh. Okay, it's a lot of money. All my money. Crap. Give that the theory on. Promos can take the stinging dagger. Let's actually sell some stuff. Dagger. Now, I know we got dubious gold ore, right? I'm giving her a fur row, but I don't have enough money for that. So we're just gonna hold off. I think they added the Falcon Saber. Yeah. We just want to get Primrose leveled up as well as Alfin, because he's not as high as I'd like him to be. So we may actually have to grind in this area for a little bit before we do the boss. Come on, I've got better things to do. I am ready. Hey, everyone's weak, weak to dark. We just got Night Ode. Night Ode. Bring your shade. Everyone broke. My turn. Okay, that new dagger is great on him. You should have studied harder. 
another level for Primrose. Like, we need Alpha to get 100. No, it's, um, we need 500 to make I am ready. An interesting dilemma. Goes nothing. Oh, light. Fight them down. Out of my way. I appreciate it. Really? Don't start things you can't finish. We're going to try to make theory on our, like, SP stealer and giver. We're gonna have a primary mage on our team at all times. Oh wow, this chest is sneaky. Empowering earring. That sounds like something that gives magic. No, it's HP. Let's actually give him the protective earring. And 50 HP we want to give to. I'd give it to her just because she's low. Night Ode, bring your shade. <laughs> I appreciate it. Really? What is the logical course of action? Good fire. <sighs> oh, flames! Rage! Wrong! This is not the right play. <sighs> All right. Maybe add. What's this? Here goes nothing. Out of my way. Uh, try this. What is the logical course of action? No good. The show is over. Four up, I was looking at Therion, I think. What a tango, huh? Out of my way. So, little Mance guy. Let's go with uh, Steel SP. <laughs> oh, no, the right uh -huh. I am ready. Night Ode, bring your shade. What is the logical okay, so course of broken. action? Let's go for an ice wind. Oh, ice! Hit them through! Bring it on! Now, what next? All light! Fight them down! Not bad. A passing grade. So, Therion is 13, Alphans 10. 
Let's get primers to 10 and then I'll feel... I don't want to sit here that long. Though. I mean... Hey, do you know you <laughs> you won't feel short. a thing. This has been really short so far. <laughs> We're gonna do a dark area, so let's go for a steel SP. I appreciate it. Really? I am ready. Nighthood, bring your shade. Everyone's broke. Alright! Of our lightning blast. And that means she learns a sports skill, which is the show goes on. Status augmentations, you get to allies, we persist for ooh, one additional turn. And she's basically gonna be our buffer, so that's perfect. You know what? I really don't think the boss is up here, so I'm just gonna. Honestly, Cyrus seems a plum. We're going for it. Okay, that is the end, that is the end, that is the end. Oh no! Let's He's going to get here. away. I won't let that happen. And where might you be off to, kitten? <sighs> Master, whatever are you doing here at this hour? Funny you should ask. A worthless little stray, this one. But she was kind enough to help me catch a rat. Yusufa! Uh, Prim... I... I'm sorry. She was quite intent on keeping her mouth shut. But my boys helped her get it open. It seems I was too lenient with the girl. I won't make that mistake again. No! Oh. 
Is it finally over? I must say, at least her last performance had some life. If she had shown that sort of potential earlier, I might have kept her on longer. <sighs> Enough. What was that? I have danced enough for you. This was the last night that I belonged to you. Oh, was it now? So some wheels do turn in that pretty little head of yours. Here I thought it a waste as empty as the desert. I saw you for the foul swine you are the first time I laid eyes on you. You would take that tone with me? You're nothing but a stupid whore! You would have died on the street if not for me! You have given me nothing. I have always danced on my own two feet. I have always chosen where I step. Who do you think you're speaking to, whore? All these years, the jeers, the beatings, the dishonor, I endured it all. All for this day, the day that man appeared before me. I need your stage no longer. I dance for myself now. Primrose. You forget yourself, little kitten. But, but I understand. This is just your little show, yes? You wanted to see your master frown. Fine! Very well! You've had your fun! <laughs> that naughty mouth of yours belongs to me! Put it where it belongs, and if you please me to my satisfaction, I will overlook your impertinence. <laughs> master... Go pleasure yourself. <laughs> Wrong answer, kitten. You know what I do with cats that bite, don't you? I put them down, just like that one. <laughs> it's a shame, Primrose. You were always my favorite. What a waste. Yes, a terrible, terrible shame. The only shame is that I could not do this sooner, Master. Time for the main event. My turn. Alright, so they're weak to dark. I don't know what he's weak to, but we're going to go with a steel SP to open with. I appreciate it. Really? That was a good one. Here we go. Alright. Hmm. I swear off better than this. Uh. Wrong answer. I am ready. Nighthood, bring your shade. Okay, we're gonna knock down these guys, <laughs> and then we're gonna let her summon her guy. Actually, go with an HP dude. I am ready. Broken. Go with a regular axe attack. Now, what next? Oh, flames! Rage! Wrong! Here goes nothing! Cool off! This is Icy's week, too. Ah! Holy moly! Out of my way. Try 
I can't guarantee that those that's gonna kill, so we're gonna do this instead. Stay strong. Now, what can I focus? It might. Okay, okay. An interesting dilemma. Go for so much to learn. Bring it on! I appreciate it. Really? I am ready. Watch me now. The peacock struck. You know, Cyrus is gonna be better. My turn. You're too kind. Bring it on. What is the logical course of action? See a non-boosted one. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh. The lion. Now, what next? Oh, ice! Pierce them through. We might not even need to actually. <laughs> What's your mine? Heavy coin pouch, nice. <laughs> Here we go. Cool off. Here you go. Oh, right there. Ah! Out of my way. Let's do this! I appreciate it. Really? Where's the nearest tavern? It was really easy. There's not one attack that almost killed everyone. Primrose. You always were different from the rest. Fire in your eyes, it burn brighter than any others. I've seen many a girl my ears, but none quite like you. You fascinated me from the start. Come, Primrose. Won't you dance one last dance for me? Dancer yourself in the end. But you won't be needing this anymore. Village of Stealth now. I need to pack some warmer clothes. Farewell. And with that, Master, I do believe my debt is paid. You are free at last, my friend. And so Primrose sets out from the shifting sands to a land of swirling snow in your quest for vengeance against the three foul crows. Where this dance will lead her, none can say. Oh, 
light. Smite them down. I am ready. Bring it on. Over here. Now, what next? Most nothing will quiet the storm. Let's do this. Here's my health bag. I am ready. The peacock struck. All oh right. my gosh, this, this sandworm is going to be harder than the boss. I cool off! No. <laughs> Maybe a sword. <laughs> no. What the? Oh I am ready. God. Okay, hold on. You like that? Okay, it's wind. An interesting dark. I think not. Did Shut. Do that? How do you like this? <laughs> what is the logical cause? <sighs> Nothing will quiet the storm. My turn. I'll try this. Ducks. All righty. I am ready. Watch me now. Try to get a poison. Oh my I am god. Ready. Okay, now we just need to run. But that thing is insanely strong. We need to get out of here. the logical course of action. <sighs> I am ready. Nighthode, bring your shade. All right. <laughs> I am ready. Nighthode, bring your shade. My turn. Uh, you're too. Nice. All right. <laughs> now. <laughs> you should have studied harder. No one turns their head at my dancing. Not catch anyone's eye. Dancing is nothing but a sorrow. Maybe it's time I hang up my dance shoes. Before I do, I want to stand on that stage and dance with Grace. Oh, I Let's we'll finish this quest real quick, and then we'll uh, head on to the next city. Is this how you do it?
Oh, we'll come back and do it later, because I don't want to risk that uh, 60% again. I see a chest down there. I'm not entirely sure how you get that. <laughs> you won't feel a thing. An interesting dilemma. Out of my way. I am ready. They're all weak to dark. Bring it on. Daggers. I am ready. There we go. Not bad. A passing grade. There we are. Another episode complete. This has been Doc Fergus, and I hope you enjoyed this episode of Off Path Traveler.